It is with utmost respect and heartfelt gratitude that we honor you on the historic occasion of our 155th commencement, conferring upon you the degree Doctor of Letters, Honoris Causa. Congratulations. The moment that Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley received his Honorary Doctor of Letters degree from Howard University. After learning more about the Prime Minister, President of the United States of America, Joe Biden, who also received an honorary doctorate, expressed that he wasn't aware of Dr. Rowley's talents. Prime Minister, I didn't know you were so talented. I just thought you were a foreign policy, you know, Latin American guy. I, I, we got to talk. All kidding aside, thank you for being a strong partner in the Caribbean and for addressing climate change and supporting democracies across the Western Hemisphere. Before Dr. Rowley received the honorary doctorate, President at the University Dr. Wayne Frederick shared some of the Prime Minister's many accomplishments. For more than three decades, you have been a member of the House of Representatives for Diego Martin West in the Parliament of Trinidad and Tobago. Since 1981, you have been a major player in the political arena of your country. Most notably, you have continued to strengthen the partnership between Trinidad and Tobago and the United States to our shared interests in many areas, including security, energy, education, agriculture, and the arts. Dr. Frederick, who is also a national of Trinidad and Tobago, shared how this country's first Prime Minister, Dr. Eric Williams, would be honored at Howard. You have encouraged me to establish an Eric Williams Endowed Chair at Howard University in Caribbean Studies. And that is something that in my post-retirement I will continue to pursue. Dr. Frederick described Dr. Rowley as a renowned social and political leader, pioneering statesman and scholar. Mahalia Joseph Wharton, TDT News.